Understanding Inflation, A Tale of Rising Prices. Hello learners. Today, we are delving into an important economic topic that affects many English-speaking countries, inflation. By the end of this video, you'll have a grasp on what inflation is, why it happens, and its impact on societies and economies. Inflation is the rate at which the general level of prices for goods and services rises, and, subsequently, purchasing power is eroding. In simpler terms, when inflation is high, every dollar you have buys a smaller percentage of a good or service. For example, if the inflation rate is 2% for the year, then a loaf of bread that costs $1 this year will cost $1.02 the next year. So, if your income doesn't increase by at least the inflation rate, you won't be able to buy as much with the same amount of money. There are various causes for inflation, but they are typically categorized into two types. 1. Demand Pull Inflation This occurs when the demand for goods and services exceeds their supply. It can be caused by increased consumer spending due to lower interest rates, increased government spending, etc. 2. Cost Push Inflation This is when the costs to produce goods and services increase. For instance, if the price of oil rises, then it might cost more to produce and transport goods, leading to higher prices for consumers. Inflation affects economies in multiple ways. 1. Purchasing power. As mentioned earlier, the purchasing power of consumers decreases. This means people can buy less with the same amount of money. 2. Savings and investments. If the inflation rate is higher than the rate of return on investments, people and businesses might lose purchasing power on their investments. 3. Business planning and budgeting. Inflation can cause uncertainty in business planning. Companies might raise prices or reduce the number of employees to combat increased costs. 4. Income redistribution. Inflation can benefit borrowers and hurt lenders if the interest rate on loans is fixed. For instance, if you took a loan at a 5% interest rate and inflation rises to 6%, then in real terms, you're paying back less than you borrowed. Like every economic phenomenon, inflation presents both challenges and opportunities. 1. Challenges it erodes purchasing power, can lead to uncertainty in economic decision-making, and might even lead to a reduced rate of growth in the national economy. 2. Opportunities. For businesses, rising prices can mean higher revenues, provided the cost of production doesn't rise at the same rate. Also, governments can benefit from inflating away their debt if they borrowed money when prices were low and are now repaying when prices are higher. Inflation, while a common economic phenomenon, has varied effects on English-speaking countries, just like on any other nations. Recognizing its causes, impacts, challenges, and opportunities is crucial for both policymakers and ordinary citizens. We hope this video shed light on the intricate world of inflation. Keep learning and see you in the next video.